And I bid unto thee all the widgiest of sands, everybody. Yes, I am here. I've arrived. At last. How are we all? I hope we're all good. And well. And happy. And generally enjoying life. As you may or may not be able to tell, today we are playing a whole new game. It's called Gate Tale. It's had recently had an update. It was recommended to me by a friend of mine. Let me see if I can get this friend in. Let me see. Is that? That's the wrong window entirely. Here we go. This is called Gate Tale. I know nothing of this game. So this is going to be interesting, to say the least. Other than, other than that it's an RPG Maker game. Let me just get it up. Here we go. That's full. Can I get it to full screen? Full screen, please. Yeah, sure. Stretch screen. Do, 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 do. There you all are. Seems to use generic RPG maker noises. Slept yield. Story. Removes dying. Okay. Normal, I guess. Warning. This game contains moving battle backgrounds that may induce motion sickness in some viewers. I'm talking directly to your eyes. What What would you two... You two, unless you have more or less eyes, prefer... <laughs> battle movement juice found. Use this and to enable or disable battle movement. I'll take battle movement, I suppose. We shall witness best game. Good morning and welcome to Gate Tale, the game which took a journey and a half to make. A year and a half to be specific, but it was worth every second. For me, but hopefully for you too. Only one way to find out there is there. We hope you enjoy this guaranteed unique experience. Let's go then. Okay. Alright then. What what is what is this? Ugh. What happened? Where am I? Am I anywhere anymore? I don't even know who I'm voicing here. Or was it always like this? Could I breathe where I came from? Was I me? Where I came from? Or am I just the mist that surrounds us? Man, this is getting philosophical straight off the bat. No. It tells me I am more. The song of it all. I have reason to be. My name is unknown. My past is unknown. My future is unknown. But why I'm here is clear. She is gone. I remember it had something to do with the gate. A great big door hidden in a deep, dark cave. I remember how much it meant to us. How much it changed everything. When something within the door. So why did I enter the gate? 
Why am I here? And not where I came from instead. Why am I... Wait! It's all clear now! Hello, Iranian aviation geek! It's because of her! She's here! Trapped in a new world through the gate! And she's waiting... For me! I'm coming to find you, Ira! Ira's a boy's name, isn't it? We already have saves, apparently, so... Guess I'll save there? Wait, what is this? Something is riveting. Would you look at that! Another human! How would you react if I told you? <laughs> Come to Gate Tail. <laughs> Cracks me up every time! I miss this! I should probably turn on the game audio, actually. I keep forgetting to do that. Here we go. As you can see, the game audio has no chill. <laughs> Name's Fred the Frog! <laughs> your new companion for the rest of your days! <laughs> <laughs> well, don't sit there and admire me too hard, human. What's your name? Um. Uh, quick, I need a silly name. Uh. Beansy, sure. <laughs> you actually call yourself Beansy! Your mother must hate you! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that kind of reaction, I'm not gonna lie. Just mad! This game already has no chill. Oh, I cannot wait till you have some experience on you. Do you know why? There is no option other than no. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? Think, human. Think! You get experience from killing things in Gagtail, and the more you have, the stronger you become! Only your pathetic kind, humans, can collect experience. When you are far too weak to get enough to match the other humans, you need my help! And I need yours! The best deal you've ever seen! <laughs> <laughs> so you're the silent type. You must know how pointless objection is. And with that said, how are you? Good, bad, confused, or help? Uh, I think I'm gonna go with help. Too bad! When an American person does a British accent, it's apparently awful. Having been on stream with Pepper, um, Pepper may know me very lux, that is. Uh, that is true. You actually thought! <laughs> Why do you think I care? <laughs> and you thought Gatel would be anything like anywhere before! Too bad! <laughs> nice meeting you. I like you already. And because of that, I'll give you a head start for making a living here in Gatel. Get experience. Make the right choices. Gain the right power. And it will all be worth it for someone in the end. I'll be watching you. Oliver Sherman too. Welcome. Arrakis or was to move. Enter enter Z space for a mobile touchpad to select it. Interact. Escorate to open the menu. Okay. Guess I'll go this way. There is only one way for me to go. Hold shift or turn on auto dash to run. Ten gold found. Save by opening your menu. Sure. 
in the tutorial. Let's go. Why is there two USA flag emojis? Because, I don't know. Praetorian breeding pasture. Please do not interact with the protoceratops. I want to interact with the protoceratops, I think. Let's interact with the protoceratops. Hello. Hello, protoceratops. I want to interact with you. What are these dudes? Velociraptors, apparently. One is the United States and the other is the Together Counties? Ah. Ooh, lizards. Okay. I can't pick those up, apparently. What's this way? Well then. Okay. Oh. Froggy. Yes, Ronnie? Is this some kind of a joke? I mean, it's been so long, there's no possible chance that... What? Uh... Hey! You kept the gates closed! Now that's unexpected! All my protoceratops are saved because of your anti-negligence! I need to, need to think of a different voice for this dude. I can't believe it! It's another one of us! It feels just like before. I never thought I'd see someone like you ever again. You know that? So I guess I have to lock my doors now. Nah, look at me. Whatever made, you, whatever made you come through the gate, whatever the reason, or whoever the cause, it was a mistake. Nah. But will you, I'll try my hardest to correct it. Even if that means I have to cancel my plans for lunch. You're quite lucky it was me who stayed here and nobody else. You know that? <sighs> Every human deserves the chance to survive. Or none of us will. See you at dinner, Rani. I have a tutorial to teach. Why do I get the feeling that this game's going to be very meta? Okay, time to read this book. He stood silent at the force standing in front of him. Its pre-sense was with ethereal and bright, almost as if it wasn't here to end everything, but instead delivered us all to the new beginning of eternal heavenly peace. That was a thing. The title reads HTTPS <laughs> YouTube.com forward slash watch watch <laughs> I'm going to see what that is. I bet it's like a Rickroll or something. Slash watch question mark B equals Well, it it linked to this. Whatever the heck this is. And no, I'm not watching it on stream. Read the book to the left. <laughs> uh, no. Don't think I want to. Okay, apparently... Uh, be not terrible. The title reads, Top 10 Reasons Why Liquid Gate Tail is Beneficial for Your Health by a Mysterious Salesman. <laughs> Just nick this guy's gold. The title reads, The Dramatic Exit, A Guide on Escaping Confrontational Situations. The best foods for protoceratops include literally anything that is a plant. That concludes the 23rd edition of Cooking for Pets, and make sure to purchase the next identical edition for only 10,000 gold. <laughs> nah, not gonna read it again. 
CBO. Search the fire. You realise this is fire, and you want to search it, right? Yes. All right. Okay. That's uh, surprising. Don't get, don't take any more chances. Okay. Teaching is hard. Here's how to make it worth it. We all know this. Even you, reader. Teaching is one of the most difficult jobs anyone can have. And oftentimes this is paid with how ungrateful your students can be towards the hard work and effort you put into every day of mentorship. Oh, good grief. This is so true. This is why in my book, we are going to discover just how you can make teaching worth it in the end. Become a lawyer or something. I don't know. I'm not a teacher, lol. No wonder this book is at the back of the shelf. Praetorian Wildlife. I should tell you readers about my experience up out one foggy morning in Pretoria, scanning the tree line from the rainforest plains for any signs of life. So this play takes place in South Africa, apparently. Ryu, hi. Until I notice two odd shapes facing each other, out of the open grasslands dotted with palm trees and the occasional brush providing hunters with cover. But I've seen plenty of life out here in my travels. It was what they were doing that really surprised me that morning. It was one of those new creatures, apparently seeming to hypnotize some lamb stock by dancing of all things. Something I would have never expected from a group of life I believed far too weak to ever survive in the wild. What fascinating potential these new beings have. Despite their weaknesses, life always appears to find a way. I feel like we all need to learn from nature. Why is there a massive great hole behind the bed? Okay. So apparently the person who was going to give me the tutorial is a... Uh, um... Run off. Fishing bridge. Just in case I forget the obvious bubbles in the water indicate fishing, of course. I repeat, just in case I forget the obvious bubbles in the water indicate fishing, of course. Requires fishing rod. That makes a whole lot of sense, to be honest. Tutorial path. Be careful in this jungle now. Only a few creatures won't hurt you. But that's not even counting the mysterious temple. I heard once that the treachery and terror that temple holds knows no bounds. I repeat, I heard once that the treachery and terror that temple holds knows no bounds. In learning! Apparently I can hit this thing. Time to mash the spacebar! This game Moonbound, it's called Gate Tail. And it's very strange, so far. The password is Gate. Couldn't really think of any way to turn that into a puzzle. The Tutorial Temple! Password, gate. Why in the world is this game? So you entered my temple unannounced, did you? Such disregard for proper manners have consequences. Yes, no, maybe, or so. Um, so? So what? Anyways, prepare for your greatest challenge yet, human. This temple of tutorials will test your combat, cunning, and endurance. And if you are to fail, you die. So don't. Welcome to the tutorial temple. The werewolves? No, eh, not bothering me much. Want personalized settings such as fonts, encounter rates, and battle animation speeds? Whatever those are. Use your options today. I repeat, use your options today. I guess. Oh, look at him. 
who appears to be running off. Found some gold. Okay. Oh! I appear to have been attacked by some kind of... What is that? Welcome to your first battle. Have you got a show which timeline you can't wrap your head around? Um, I'd have to think about that. As you can see, a totally normal user <laughs> has emerged and began to attack. This is one of the nearly endless types of enemies here in Gate Tail. While they aren't sentient in almost all cases, enemies still represent a vital piece in Gate Tail's world. Experience. Go to your special skills to use your check ability. Let's see what this enemy is all about. Utahraptor, type physical quirk, being everywhere. The Utahraptor is a species of Praetorian fauna named by the my humans who relate to this creature to dinosaurs from their own world. Numerous but fragile, the Utahraptor is a common threat to every being in the Praetorian region of Gate Tail. Great job! As you read, the Utahraptor is a physical type. This means they're strong against light and weak against magic. And wow, that looks like exactly what type you are! Every element has its counters and resistances, and any successful human here knows that knows exactly what they are! So first, we'll start off with fire, one that gets a lot of stigma because of a friend of mine. Do you mind? <laughs> the tutorial text being fucking interrupted! <laughs> By the enemy! <laughs> okay, that got me. That got me. That actually got me. <laughs> oh, oh, goodness me. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> and it's interrupting the tutorial text. <laughs> uh, goodness me. Good gracious me. Anyway. Stop! Check your items. Oh, we've been attacked, apparently. Use this one! Now you have magic points, the most important health bar besides health, obviously. MP is your energy. It allows you to heal, perform skills, or even stuff that'll land you in prison. <laughs> okay. We'll stick with your strike ability for now. Kill it! Regret, apparently. Whack. Whack. Great learning! You've got the hang of this already! Maybe I'm not so rusty after all. Beansy was victorious. 50 experience received, 10 gold found. Ash is found. Beansy is loud over 3. Regain learned. Guard learned. Warm up learned. Laugh learned. You have completed the first task, but don't feel victorious just yet. Your next challenge awaits you, and it surely will not be taken lightly. It actually won't, though. I'm liking you already. And the best part? That was Sarka Sam. Your next talk awaits you, and you should be mortified. I will be seeing you very, 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 very soon. If someone paid you, do would do would you binge watch every single movie and TV show from the MCU back to back? Hell fucking no. I like having a soul. Told you I'd see you soon. Crap, is disguise. It's all gone. I got. Gonna... <laughs> Completed the first task, did you? Haha, <laughs> such mystery. Do you feel accomplished? Yes, yes, or... Mm. Well, don't! 
The next and final task will be, will be out of unfair levels of difficulty, which will make what you did before utterly effortless in comparison. In order for you to truly know the way to survive in the harsh land of Gate Tail, this is a must. It's okay, I have elite gamer skill. What are you? Let's just both hope you won't be dead after I'm done. Because that'd be really unfortunate. For you. So, prepare for the end of the tutorial temple. And your life! Kidding. Yes, I do that to everyone, okay? It's another staple of the tutorial experience. But yeah, the next task is way worse than me just fighting you. Enjoy the room behind me that definitely isn't crawling with the creature you just fought. I'm not sure what happens in the next room. Hold shift or turn. Dash to run. Well, definitely... <laughs> I'm sure that whatever happens in the next room, hold shift or turn on a dash to run, will definitely not be that and instead be something really cool. Save by opening your menu. Before all of that, what's your name? I need to know before you do the dying. Nice to meet you, Beansy. I'm Josh. Your new and only tutorial guide in Gate Tail. Everyone else moved on to better things a very long time ago. If they survived, of course. Alright, exposition time. So basically, Gate Tail is an alternate dimension to your own, and like every other human before you, you traveled here through the gate and didn't to never return to where you came. Don't think about escaping, alright? I promise the longer you take to realize that, the more it hurts. And frankly, you have enough to be sad about, because few humans value a lot of different things. But if there was one desire that we all have in common, it's the magical property that everything and everyone in Gate Tail possesses. Experience. All humans are on a constant search for experience because of the power it gives us. And frankly, you should be too. Trust me when I say killing enemies is a must here in Gate Tail, no matter how hard it can be sometimes. But what is an enemy and who is a friend? There's a fine line between self-defense and self-intention. If they don't stop attacking until they're dead, then they're an enemy that can be killed for experience. But if they give you the option to show mercy... I need to warn you about someone. Because here in Gate Tail, nothing will ever compare to him in pure dread and fear. You'll never know the next time he'll show up, and what could be lost when he does. If there was one thing I want you to leave with after this tutorial, I'll n I'd never think twice about what to say. Beware the frog. You need every bit of power you can when the frog attacks again. So please, get experience. And thus, that concludes the temple. The rest of your tutorial awaits you out in the jungles and swamps of Pretoria. And there's no other humans out there to threaten your life, so feel free to enjoy the simple prehistoric atmosphere with much worry. Endless possibilities, wealth, and power await. If you survive the next room. Don't die, alright? I get the feeling that Fred is not the nicest of people. Or frogs, for that matter. You won't need this in the next room, but hold shift to run. I repeat, hold shift to run. But you won't need this in the next room. Make sure to save, save just in case, though. Okay. Yep. Welcome to Gate Tail, Beansy. Well, gotta bounce. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Oops. Wrong way. No. Run. Ow. Okay. I died. Good thing I saved. Oh, now they're chasing me. Good grief. Okay. Um. Right then. It's time to run like hell then. Good load. Okay, that that was certainly a thing that happened. Life Asper found. I still remember the password. Need a Jojo Redemption AU, do we?
Well, I, I'm here again. 70 gold. Okay. Okay. I can't see anything. Okay. Just yes or no. Yes, I think. Would you ever play Dark Souls on stream? Hell no. And if you did, how many times would you yell at it? Okay. Okay. <laughs> what the... What the heck? Okay. That definitely happened. Okay. Okay. Do I... How long do I have to wait? I... Okay, there we go. Right, now I'm going to save my game before anything else happens. So I don't have to sit through that weirdness again. I found 80 gold. Don't jump in the well. Noted. It's like how the options for the will were just yes and no. <laughs> Hello. Oh, I appear to have encountered a, a thing. I need to heal myself. Like, now. Ow! Laugh in the face of danger, apparently. <laughs> what? What? Okay. Avatops, type water, quick pacifist. An often true little creature, the Avatops spends most of its life swimming and searching for seaweed to graze on, often prey to water predators because of this. I'm dying again, aren't I? Hang on. Gotta heal myself again. Multiple times over. That's better. Okay, physical. Or magical, even. Magic! No damage! Okay. Right, um, guess I gotta heal again. Menace the Otter Slime, welcome! How are you doing? I'm playing a very bizarre game called Gate Tail. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Yeah, I'm dead. Thought so. Right then. Noted, don't, uh... Don't mess with the dinosaurs, I suppose. I get the feeling I can't actually do that yet. I cannot at the moment, apparently. Now it's the temper! <laughs> Just kidding! Pointless, isn't it? Don't you worry, though. As your new companion for all time, I will give you a far greater lesson, almost free of charge. If you want to survive, stick only with me. Remember what I said? Get all the experience you can! With no exceptions! Too simple to fail, yet so many do. So you better not go down their path, human! You wanna know why? <laughs> Look what I can do! Just made you stronger! Charge! Why would you ever not trust me? <laughs> now get to gaining, human! I'm struggling to stand the, understand the objective of this game, so will I. Experience and awaits! 
Oh, great. Okay, um, all right. Guess I'll do a check on it. Type Earthquake Bonehead. The Pagasaurus used to have another name long ago, but the human beings of Gaketail didn't care to pronounce it. That makes this hard-headed creature one of, one of the only in Pretoria which was named correctly, even if it didn't last. Let's whack it then, I suppose. Um, magic? Ow! Rude! The objective is to discover the objective. Apparently that is... apparently so. Huh. Pomf. Ow! Ow! Do I gotta save again? Good grief. This is all very weird. Oh, do I have to slip through Fred's weird exposition again? Yes, I do. Let's let's save the game then. Here. Right. Item. This is a Pokemonish kind of dealie where encounters are completely random. Open. What have I just opened? Oh, great. Ham. Mom. Birthdays are awesome. Yes, they are. Yeah. I won. I am Winard. Skill, can I, uh... Kill myself outside of battle? No, apparently I'm automatically fully healed upon leveling up. That's useful. Useful to know and useful to have as a skill. What's this sign say? See, that wasn't bad. You're a natural. If you do a livestream where you host a Hearts of Iron 4 match with your viewers, I would if I liked Hearts of Iron 4. I don't. Okay. The fuck is this game? <laughs> um, you 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 have uh, just your 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 guess is as good as mine. I couldn't possibly. The tent is locked. Oh boy! <laughs> I couldn't. Po Long ago, I lived in this here campground, but now it only serves as a puzzle. In order to pass, listen closely. Find the key to the gate, and you'll be able to pass to the next area. I repeat, find the key to the gate and you'll be able to pass to the next area. But I'm not sure you'd want to. Locked. Find the key. Tent gate key. <laughs> yeah, Lamar, it does seem like it opens the tent. <laughs> I'm a door closer, so I'm going to close the door. Not fun. Hmm. Have you ever 
ever played War of Rights? No. This, this, this is... I've... The thing is, I've played weirder. Fine, I guess you are quite lonely here. What is it, Josh? Open. Guess I'll open that then. Kill these apparitions and get a little of their stats. Sounds good to me, frankly. Right, okay, so pulses won't do much. Neither do attacks. Okay. I do wish it would do that, it's rude. Strike? You know what, that seems like a considerably better idea than... Why are we placing so many signs? That seems like a much better idea than anything else, frankly. So why don't you like this tree again? Why? Yeah. Well, it shouldn't be here. I spent years keeping and manipulating the environment, making everything but what I want banished. <laughs> making everything but what I want banished out of Pretoria. And if this tree is to stay, the entire system I have created could fall apart in an instant. It's just a tree, though. Interesting of you, <laughs> out of all people, to say that melody. Oh, radish snort, they're here! Uh, is the tree really that bad? Let's forget about the tree! Is there something behind me? Should I be worried? No! Not at all! <laughs> no, enough about me. How are you on this wonderful gate-tail day? The sun sure is shining like it does! Don't you love enjoying it in my direction and not behind you? You bet I do! I love sunburn! Ah. Do you need a doctor? I am perfectly healthy! Out of everyone from Homestar Runner, who can you impersonate best? Well, uh, Strong Bad is the only character I know out of Homestar Runner, so I couldn't possibly tell you. Somehow I doubt that. But guess what? I'm betting about now you want to know why I came here in the first place, right? When barely any other humans ever do? Right? Yeah. <laughs> it's because of Jacob. Remember the thing he's been doing? Well, he's finally close to getting it done. And once he is, we're finally going to be free from this terrible hell forever. And it's all because of him. Isn't he the best boyfriend ever? He told me that the best possible outcome requires you, for whatever reason that might be. So I decided to be nice and get you on your way. We are almost ready to finally do what every human thought was impossible. We're going to open the gate! We're going to be free! Uh, so he's close. But he said it was too unstable. Not anymore! How can he be sure? But that's the thing about Jacob, Josh. He knows. I'm just going to turn on the light quickly, because it's very dark in here. Right, the light is now on, and as an added bonus, I've got some what's-its. Uh, hmm. I'll be there. Uh, pardon me. Soon too, right? When I can. And you can soon? I don't think so. Right now my hands are a little full. With the tree? Let's just say that. My animation had a slight stroke there. Um, I would have a I would have a com have a comment, but my grandfather who recently died had a stroke some years before. Some years ago. So, yeah. Yes, goodbye. Great travels to you. Bye. Oh. Wow, a bush just appeared. How cool. Better not look behind it, even though that'd be very counterproductive. 
All right, TG, talk to you later. All right, talk to you later. <laughs> okay. Woo! Nice seeing you again so soon, Beansy. Look, th this usually never happens. Melody visiting like that was legendary in its rareness. Even more so was Jacob needing me. Let's just say I'm used to doing my own thing. Forever. But you shouldn't worry about that. Because you have other things to look forward to. Spiders! Okay. I hope it's the most painless thing so far, I really do. But tree spiders have cost me a lot of work throughout the years. And for the premium tutorial experience, you should know that what that's like too. I may even put a stop to it. But before I leave, please remember. If you ever see any other human in Gate Tail, hide! Because whatever happens in your journey, our kind is what kills us the most. True. Statistically, the most dangerous animal in the animal is people. Slurp says slurp 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 <laughs> the fools! They have no idea they let me. Evil tree is. <laughs> Can I talk to it again? My plans are about to take forth now. <laughs> Evil tree. Everything looks so samey. Oh, spider. Hello. It's going that way. As such, I think I'm going to go a different way. Escape. Because I can't be bothered with this game's combat. I can't be bothered. Leave. Can't pick the carrots or parsnips, whatever the fuck they are. I just realised that gold doesn't actually do anything yet. This game has combat. Yeah, it does. Fun fact: as you journey through Gate Child, you will soon realise, start to realise that most things you, that most things here want you dead. This includes the elusive and ecosystem. System shaping tree spider, a problem for the land of Pretoria ever since their mysterious introduction. Because of the threat of such powerful arachnids, I have decided to install a sign to better prepare humans for such a possible spider attack. One, they tire easily and hate being caught off guard while resting. Two, if they stop moving at desaturating color, that is your time to strike back and hopefully scare them off. Three, they won't attack you if you don't move. That includes when they jump. If they are about to leap, you will get a cue where you where you will have then have to cease all movement to avoid injury. Let's hope the spiders don't target you on their journey, but, but if they do, this will be your best resource to help you survive the encounter. Okay, let's be careful with the spiders then. Indeed, I can't- I can't even be bothered with this game's combat. I found a cobweb in a chest. In a place full of cobwebs. That escape sound is hellish? Sure it is. Okay, this game- it, it, it's made me save. Whether I want to or not. Oh look, it's the tree spider. Don't move. Better just not move then, I suppose. Went the wrong bloody way. Run! Skip? Yeah, sure. Oh, it's Fred again. Did you miss me? Hi, Angel. 
Why are you even spending time with those worthless humans? And I thought you had sense! Incorrect route. Okay. Do you even realize they only see you as an experience? All you are to them is nothing more than their own gain! Humans only exist to kill for power! <laughs> Trust me! I know that's easy for you. But you're different. I know you are. You have a mind of your own. But most importantly, you have me! And that, my friend, will separate you from the rest. You will finally be who you were always meant to be. If you keep going, that is. Do as I say, and you'll be rewarded. Do as I say, and everything will you want will be for your attention. Do as I say, and you will be rewarded beyond your wildest dreams! <laughs> Voicing Fred is starting to really do a number on my throat. What's the most frustrating game you've ever played? That's that's a good question. I would have to think about it. Um, I would have to go with Castlevania Lords of Shadow, um, the final final boss of the final DLC. Specifically the Resurrection DLC of Castlevania Lords of Shadow. Which is so ridiculously difficult that I actually had to cheat in order to finish it properly. Get stronger! Get better! Get more experience! Do what they do, but for a reason they could never comprehend! Be different, like you've always wanted to be! And you'll be rewarded! <laughs> As for me, I'll have, I'll have other matters to attend to! Matters I've long imagined doing for far longer than you can ever know! So don't make me break from violence in vain! <laughs> oh, so don't make my break from violence in vain, human! Because I'm about in my limit. I warn you! Don't trust anyone with me! Humans will never help others if it doesn't increase their own power. And if you try to befriend them, if you try to escape without me, if you do anything against what you should, it will come back to bite you. Victorian River Bridge. Gold, which appears to do nothing in this game. Run away from the Pachysaurus. Because I can't be asked. What beautiful water, don't you think? I'm glad you understand. Back in the day, humans like you rode these rushing streams for hours on end. Following the water, you could travel all the way to Everglade without ever touching the ground. But nowadays, it seems human beings are too advanced for such transportation, which left these rivers unventured for far too long. Unless... Here's a token of thanks. Use it well. Leaf found. Now he just says, unless. I have no fishing rod still, so... Yeah. Swampy passings. Escape the Utah Raptor. I'm about to get a voice loss. Majugasaurus. Type physical quirk of the hard truth. This Majugasaurus is one of the many many of its species which serves near serves the near the top serve as near the top of Pretoria's food chain. The reason it isn't the highest, because of you. You need the experience after all. You'll die without it. Okay, I can't run. Uh strike, I guess. Yeah, I think I'm going to die with it, as well. <laughs> and funnily enough, this thing is... so far... could be easier. Okay. He said, dying immediately. Yeah, well, you know what you said about that, about frustrating games? Oh, no, wait, hang on.
Yeah, this game is starting to get real frustrating. Real fast. Right, so the life asper does nothing. I don't see how this is enjoyable. Well, I can't... What the fuck am I meant to do? What am I supposed to do? I don't understand. Am I supposed to use the leaf here? To make it leaf me alone? Item. Leaf. No. That does fuck all. Why does its... Why does its damage keep just going up? I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. So if you go that way, you die. Out of the waste. Ah. Get out of here. Please, please, for the love of all that's sensible and sane, do not tell me that I have to have to actually do the fucking combat in this game! I beg of you! Right, I don't have a fishing rod. If I go that way, I will die. Oh, uh, frogs. Guess I'll escape them too. Can I can I leave, please? Right then, that that's so uh, that that just kill that just murders me within a few few turns. So I can only presume that that's not where I'm meant to go. Is this what you meant with by incorrect route, damn Daniel? This game is starting to frustrate me. You just said it as a filler comment. I'm just going to backtrack until I find something else. Be careful, Ryu. Speak of the devil, and he shall appear. I 
Anxiety the game? More like wholly unfair the game. I'm getting very tempted by the well again. Fuck off, Utah Raptor. Can't be asked with the combat in this game because it's already frustrating me enough. Tents locked. I know. Close the gates. I've already been this way. Can I go back to the tutorial temple? Means got the, got the upper hand. I don't care, frankly. I'm going back to the tutorial temple. It was the only part of this game where anything made sense. They do go good. I believe they're called Froobs over here. I'm just going to go all the way back. Oh, Froobs and Froobs. I've already read that, haven't I? Oh yeah, I forgot I can turn random encounters off entirely. Well, I'm back where I started. I don't know why I went all the way back here. From that, I can presume that there's literally nothing I can do.
God, I hope this isn't one of those pretentious games. If it did turn out to be such a game, it would be a pain at the bottom. Honestly. More gold that does nothing. So I guess I have no, no other response. Other recourse than to just get repeatedly murdered by this fucking dinosaur? There are so many parallels between this and Undertale that make me th make me feel like it's like trying to pull like Undertale but not It still bites me. Let's try guarding then. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Somebody please explain what I'm supposed to do. Right then, so, um, do I have to laugh in the face of danger? Wait, it missed and yet I still took damage. Check again? I just keep dying! Don't get it! I don't get it! I don't fucking get it! Auto? Starting to frustrate me. I'm getting frustrated. I'm starting to not like it. And I feel bad because some because 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 the person who recommended this told me that this game was really, really fucking good. Oh. 
I'm not saying that. I don't have enough TP to use Elemental Surge, so... I know, I'll try and restore my... I'll use the Leaf to restore my TP and hope that I can u see what happens if I use Elemental Surge? No, apparently not. I can't. Auto battle style skills. The goal of the game is to get so annoyed that you'll leave and never... You know what? I'm going to... I'm... You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go onto the Steam forums and work... And see what people's responses were to people asking about this... About this enemy. One moment, please. There are no discussions. Guides? There are no tutorials! Am I just expected to fucking grind? Please, God tell me I'm not supposed to just fucking grind! Use Elemental Surge. What does it do? None of that made any sense whatsoever. I'll use Elemental Surge again, I suppose. Uh-huh. 